What do you want from me, Lara? You are still offended with me. I am not offended with you, Lara. We are over that, okay? Okay. So, what about the good cost of? I have withdrawn the case, Gabriel. Okay, then. We are cool. Baby. Sweep here, Lara. I don't like these flowers. You used to love flowers, Gabriel. Not anymore, Lara. I am different now. Okay, I need those food to eat. I am not hungry. Baby, please, let's eat together and then talk. We don't have anything else to say. Clean this up, cause I'm sweeping in this room, Lara. I know you are still pissed off at me. When is Jesse coming home? He will be home by next week. Okay, I need to see my son. I've missed him. I can call my mom to let him come back. No, allow him to enjoy the break. Let him come back at the agreed date we choose already. Okay. And don't worry, I won't ever. But you again, that's a promise. I won't sleep outside again. And I'm not seeing any man. I don't want to hear these explanations. Where are you going? Sister, I'm going home. To your mom or where? Yes, to mom's place. You should still stay with me, Susan. I don't want you to leave. I would come around, sister, when I'm back. Why do you want to go? Why? I've missed him. Plus, I've got some money with me. I get. I will come see you once I'm back. When are you leaving? By the end of today. My lover is coming to take me to his place. Didn't you say you don't have a lover anymore? We patched things up already. I see. That's good. And sister, be careful of Chris. Yes, ma. I like him for you, as he makes you. But just watch him before making any decision. Yes, ma. I've heard you. I miss you already, Suzanne. You are different. Babe, I am sorry. No problem. Have you eaten or should I serve you? Let's forget about food. What are we talking about? Nothing really. You are hungry, I know. No, I'm not hungry, Stanley. Let me get you something to eat. Babe. It's nothing really. Less important right now, believe me. Everything that concerns you is important to me, Ada. Everything. Okay. Then what are we meant to do today? I... You should pick your phone. Babe, wait. Helen, see, we owe you. I mean, you don't hold me. My son does. I hope you're still interested in him. <laughs> Mommy. He won't beat you. He isn't a woman beater. I know, ma. Hope he came to check on you at home. Yes, he did. I said at home like you said I should and he came. Then what happened? Nothing, ma. We just stopped a bit before he left. That's how it starts. Good morning, Mommy. Good morning, ma. Good morning, Helen. You didn't come yesterday. I had an emergency, that's why, ma. How are you doing, ma? I'm fine, thank you. I want to make a cup of tea. I will make it for you and bring it for you. Don't worry, focus on what you're making for mom. Baby. You're up already. How was your night? I couldn't sleep well. I've been trying to remember what I forgot yesterday. I told you it's nothing. Baby, why won't you tell me? Baby, I'll be going out this morning. Can we go to where we were meant to go to yesterday? I don't remember what that is. You do? But you are pissed off, I know. Do you need me to make you breakfast before going out? Where are you going? To the store. I want to check on them there. Okay. Work is calling again. Let me make you breakfast. Why is she calling me this early? Hello? Good morning. Please, let me call you back, okay? I'm still at home. Gabriel, good morning. I'm the one. What do you want? I brought you a cup of tea. I don't need it. Told you, didn't I? Please open the door then. Good morning, babe. Good morning. Gabriel, I need you a cup of tea. I don't need it. Lara, it's too early for us to have an argument. Don't you agree? Yes. You should take your clothes to the other room. So I will prevent you from getting ready on time. You're not doing that. Are you sure of that? I'm not doing that. Yes, I want us to be like we used to be, babe. You are fine, Lara. We are not fine. He keeps walking away from me continuously. What do I need to do to get us back to normal? What? How did it all go yesterday? Good. Now that we have both done the remembrance, can we now talk about children? What remembrance, mom? Was yesterday not her late parents' remembrance? Oh, oh, I forgot. Oh, okay. And why didn't you tell me you went to the cemetery yesterday? Yes, I went, ma'am. I'm so sorry I forgot, babe. I'm sorry. It is nothing, really. I know you've been busy with everything. Can we go today? 
No, I've got other plans. Should I get you your food now? No, I have to make this up for you. It isn't a big deal. Believe me, Stanley. You two should come. Let's talk about my grandchildren. Not now, mom. I will get your food. Why didn't you tell me your wife had tried other method of having a baby? How do you know that? I find out. So, why won't you two just make up a decision about this? See, son, you can have children. I know nothing is wrong with you. Nothing is wrong with my wife too, mom. Son, see, I know you love your wife so much. But we need to take action now. How about if you just get someone pregnant and take the baby from her? Mom, no man will just give me the baby like that. I know people will do this. We will just pay them off. I'm not interested in that, mom. Neither am I going to have a second wife. Tara, what is it again? What is it? Baby, I am sorry. You're starting to get angry and irritated now, Lara. What is this? Ma, I... I bought food for him. You cooked and brought for my husband to eat. Helen! Stop with the shout. Stop it now. Helen, didn't I tell you not to cook for my husband? You did, ma. But he asked me to cook for him. Keep well. Really? Yes. She's cooking for me as fault. So you would allow her to cook for you, but you won't allow me? Helen, you may leave. If I want more, I will let you know. Okay, sir. Come back here, Helen. Come here. I don't want to see you here again. I don't want you here. Helen, go back to the kitchen, okay? This is my house, and I'm not the rules here. Okay, sir. You're walking out on me, Gabriel. Gabriel! I need to wait for work. You should be going there now. What did you give my son? Nothing, ma. He doesn't listen to me anymore. He thinks he knows what he's doing, but he doesn't. Mommy, he's stubborn. Hada, you are the one who is making all this difficult for me. How, mommy? Why won't you agree to what I said? Bring someone in, Ada. Mommy, okay, okay. I will look for someone. Good. Mine is to have grandchildren, Ada. Even if you would be angry, he will still have to soften towards you. He loves you, Ada. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you want to take me out? There's something special here for you, believe me. I should still be on my bed, Chris. Is that something bad? What is this? The surprise I told you. Marry me, Aaron. What? Yes, please marry me, Aaron. I want you to be my wife. Oh my god, I'm not joking. No, this is real. Please say yes to me. Yes, yes. She said yes to me. The visa will be ready soon. Okay, Stanley. So, how is your first day here? It went really well, though I feel kind of lonely. You felt lonely? Yes. Staying all alone in this big house isn't fun at all. Do you want to bring anyone to stay with you? The only person I want is you. So, Su Susan? Stanley, I don't know how I can thank you for all this, but I've decided I will give myself to you as a gift. You don't need to do that. Aren't you attracted to me? Don't you feel what I feel as well? That doesn't mean I should pursue the feelings. So, you admit having feelings for me? Susan? All I could think of was you. See, I've lost a lot of things, and I'm not even asking for anything here between us. I just want us to have a good time, Stanley. I am married. I know. Okay. Let's go to the bedroom. What do you see? Come with me. I don't know why he drags me to shop. I want to get something for Chris. You and lover boy. How are things? Things are fine between us. What about you and Stanley? Stanley is different, Joy. In what way? He forgot that yesterday was his parents' remembrance. Really? Yes, Joy. It's unlike him to forget things. Maybe he's stressed from work. I think so too. But I felt really pained about it. He's been acting different lately. He would act normal soon enough. Or maybe he's cheating. What do you think? You and this cheating, cheating. I am just thinking of it. He could be cheating. He's not that kind of man. What of your sister? How, Susan? She's fine. She moved out of my place already, back to her normal life. I don't know. I wanted her to help me and Stanley. No, no, no. She isn't going to carry any baby at that. Joy, you didn't even allow me to finish what I was saying. That's because I know what you wanted to say already. Joy, come on, please. The answer is no. No, she almost lost her life. I'm not going to be a party to that anymore. Not at all. Wow, this is nice. 
I know, man. Congratulations, man. I'm happy for you. Thanks, man. Finally, you are getting married again. After how many years? I know. Well, while you are planning on your marriage, I'm planning on getting a divorce. What? Yeah. I want to divorce Lara. Lara, did you get my message? What message? I see. Didn't you get it then? Look at me. Irene, I'm really not in the mood for that. Why? What happened? I'm losing him, Irene. Losing who? I've lost him. I've lost Gabriel. That's not possible. It has happened already. What happened? Talk to me. Everything happened. I wish I didn't arrange him. This isn't the time for regret, Lara. It is the time for regret, Irene. Why did I arrest him? Why? What happened exactly? Talk to me. He doesn't want to be around me. He doesn't want to talk to me. Like, no matter how I try, he just ignores me. He's still angry. I know, but I've apologized over and over again. What else am I to do? I want a divorce. Come on, man. You can't be serious about that. I'm very, very serious here, man. A divorce is a big deal here, man. I know. I can't stay with her anymore. I can't just do that. You should calm down. I'm very calm. You both need to work things out. I don't think I can ever work out things with her. No, man. You can. The one who treated me like trash, locked me up and left me there. Man, not enough reason to want a divorce. Maybe to you. Gabriel, divorce isn't something you want to go through with. Believe me. Man, it's something I want to do. Anyways, congratulations on your engagement. Thanks, man. And please don't go on with this divorce. Counseling is better. Definitely not going to counseling. Stanley, I can't remember the last time I felt this way. Okay. You are the man, Stanley. The man himself. I don't know what to even say. You don't have to say anything. Being here with you is all that I love. Susan. Don't worry. My mouth is sealed here on everything that happened here. Thank you. How is my visa coming up? It's going well. Should be ready in three weeks time at most. Really? Yeah. I can't wait for that. So I'll be leaving here soon. Yeah, you would. Thank you, Stanley. Should I make us something to eat? No, no, no. Don't worry about that. Are you sure? I'm a great cook. I'm not hungry, plus I got something to attend to. Would you come back later? Come and see me again. I'm not sure about that. I understand. You should go out and have some fun instead of staying here at home. Maybe I will do that since you suggested it. I would consider it then. I don't know what to do, Warren. I think you should keep apologizing for now. For how long? For as long as you can. Show you are sorry. Make something nice for him. He's not eating my food. He now eats Ellen's food. You don't mean it. I am serious here. He eats our food. He ate it this morning. Wow. But that's not an issue. It is an issue. My husband isn't eating my food. He's not touching me. He isn't talking to me. He's clearly ignoring me like I'm not even there. And you're saying it's not an issue. I'm sorry. It is a big issue. A big one. What if he asks for a divorce? I don't think he should do that. How about if you use Jess to beg him? I don't want him to be caught up in all this. Use Jess to beg him and see how it works. I'm sure he would soften him towards you. God, what is all this now? Why is this happening? My husband hasn't been this angry before. He is always sweet and loving towards me, even when we have our fights. But this time around, he is different. Like I know he is mad and angry at me. He will say something to you. Give him time. Why start apologizing? Or you dress like I suggested to you. Joy, so you won't really listen to me. I don't want to. It's different this time around. How different? Isn't it the surrogate stuff again? It's not. It's something else. What is it? I want to drug my husband. What? Are you serious? Yes, I'm very serious here. Why would you want to do that to him? Why? So that I can have a baby of my own. I don't understand you. I get Stanley drugged and then your sister comes in to sleep with him and then she gets pregnant for him. What nonsense are you saying? I am not saying any nonsense. You are saying nonsense? What stupid suggestion is that? You better not let anyone know of this idea, Ada. His mom knows about it already. Becca, ma. Thank you. Mom is Stanley, my friend, you're welcome. Thank you. How are you doing, my friend? I'm doing fine, I thank God and you. I am fine as well. I told myself that I must come and see you today. I was also planning to come see you too within the week. I knew it already. So I said before you come, let me come. Where is Gabriel? He has gone to work. That is good. I didn't even know he's gotten another job. I am happy for you. Yes, he has gotten a job with your son. 
don't you know? With my son. Yes, he's working on one of the styles of Stanley. That is good. I didn't even know. You know I have not been at home with them. Yes, that's true. What do I make for you now? What I would do fine. Helen, bring something for my guest. I wanted to even ask how the whole court stuff went. Nothing like court. Everything has been withdrawn. Stanley's mom was the one who even made the suggestion. What? Yeah, she said we'll drug him and then he'll impregnate someone. We'll pay her off and then take the baby as ours, mine. And you agreed to it? I did eventually. It's a good idea, Joy. I've tried surrogacy, I've tried IVF, and it didn't work. This is a bad idea. I know, but it can work out. Imagine if he's able to impregnate her and the baby stays this time around. I'll have a child. It is a bad plan. Have you thought of the possibility that maybe be the woman doesn't want to give you the baby what will you do she would give the baby to me the baby has got her blood i think it's a bad idea your baby can help me out i just need someone i can trust don't trust anyone that much with your husband joy help me please ada this is a bad idea i can't help you so you won't talk to susan for me right you won't she isn't in town i told you already and even if she was this is a crazy idea i'm sure stanley would agree to this if you told him about it i don't think so too don't be so desperate ada okay fine i've heard you and don't tell anyone else about this. Do you know how many ladies are desperate out there to have your man? Then you want to use your own hands to bring another woman into your husband's house. What if she runs with the baby? What if she becomes a burden to you, Ada? Have you thought about this? We can be able to control Susan. I'm sure she would help out. You better not do this, Ada. Don't, okay? Welcome, ma. Thank you, Grace. Did anyone come to ask for me? No one, ma. I placed some new orders today, ma. Keep doing whatever you are doing, Chris. I know you will do it well. Thank you, ma. Chris, you a man. Tell me, how can I really apologize to a man I offended? How can I show him that I regret my actions to him? It will depend on what you did. Okay. That's the only way I can tell you what to do. But from a general perspective, all you need to do is apologize and then change. Stop all those things he always complains on and then make his favorite food. What if he ignores me? Keep doing it. I'm sure he would come around. It's not easy, Chris, but thank you. Is everything alright, ma? Yeah, everything is fine. Continue with what you were doing. I will be heading them soon. She was the one who helped him. Wow, this is good. I am still surprised she had arrested him. You have to see how she has been doing around the house. She's totally uncomfortable and she's doing everything she can to make sure he forgives her. He shouldn't so. I saw once I know him. Is this your girl married? No, she's not. Why do you ask? I have a job proposal for her. You want to take my cook? No way. No, not that way. Remember the suggestion you gave to me to look for someone whom my son can lay with? Yes, I remember. Have you done it already? Not yet. I haven't found the lady that will do it. And that's why I'm thinking maybe Helene can be the lady to carry my son's baby, my crown child. Hmm. I can't believe my eyes. I know. You know we got this place for you. Yeah, I did. I was shocked because I didn't even ask for it. Suzanne, you have gotten a keeper here. Don't lose him. I know. Are you both not dating or what? Not really. That means something is already going on. I won't say so, but we slept with each other. You guys did? Damn. I know, girl. And it was all on me. I was the one who initiated it, put him right in the mood, and led him to the room. How was it? It was good. Really good. Uh, I'm happy for you, Suzanne. Right from the house to all this. Girl. I know, and my visa would soon be ready. I'm envious of you right now. I want to be you. So you cheated and felt cool about it? I felt this way like you, and I promised myself that I wouldn't do it. And you stopped? No, I didn't stop, man. I was so into this lady I was dating then. I would have married her if I could, but that wasn't possible. So you kept cheating? Yeah, and I was never caught. I played it too well. So I should play mine well too? Man, it's up to you, but you can do it. You can handle your wife at home and decide peace. But you can call it off whenever you want. I never imagined myself as a cheater. Man, you've got to try outside for children. That will be a mess up. You worry too much. Ada will be broken if she find out about this, I know. Then don't tell her about it. You can never end things now. I will avoid her and just help her with the visa like I promised. Fair enough. Is that why she end things with you? No, not because of cheating. I was careful enough not to get caught. Are you gonna cheat on Aaron as well? What? Will you cheat on a man? I'm not sure I would do that. She would leave me if she knew. I shouldn't have cheated. I'm going to need a 
drink. You get over it, believe me. Let's face it, we all know.